Hi, this is Tim. And this is Wendell. And today we're gonna to do some fun experiments to try to take some of the magic out of electricity. Before we get started in this, be sure to uh, like this video. It really helps keep us going making these. And put in the comments what you think of this video and what you think would make a good, fun kids experiment video. This is kind of a new idea for us. Uh, one, the kids wanted to be in some videos. Also, we just a lot of times have fun doing crazy experiments like this. So let's get started. So when you think about magnetism, we usually think about repelling magnets. <laughs> and, and when they flip around, the magnets attracting each other. Will you take this back apart? Well, I explain what we're going to do today. So what we have today is we have a roll of aluminum foil and then we have a tube that was part of a roll of aluminum foil. And we just re removed the aluminum foil from it and this may look like it's modified in some way but it's not. It's just where we've been playing with it a lot is this was a full ro roll of aluminum foil. Wendell, come on I need a magnet. You will get one magnet in one minute. Here, go ahead, let me see it. So when we think about magnetism, beyond magnets attracting and repelling each other, usually we think about magnets sticking to things. But they do so much more than that. And they really are one of the basic building blocks of our electrical generation system. When we're transferring electricity, we usually use copper, but it's not in any way attracted to magnets but they do interact with them, same as aluminum. So when you, your electrical wire coming to your house, chances are is aluminum. And while magnets do not stick to aluminum, they do interact with it. And, and that's really apparent when you drop the magnet through this tube. So if we put this down, you wanna drop it through? One, you can even hear, hear the difference. Go ahead, drop it through. It's really loud. But this one, when we drop it through, Try again. But this one we drop it through is not nearly as loud and that's because it's going a lot slower through there. So what we're using the aluminum for is to show how magnets actually interact with things besides magnetism. And this is the basis of electrical current generation. So if we drop it through the cardboard tube without any aluminum, one 1,000. So really, it takes it about a second to fall through the tube. But if we drop it through the aluminum one, one 1,000, two 1,000, it takes nearly twice as long. And what is happening here is called an eddy current. And so the aluminum can conduct electricity. It can, electrons can move freely back and forth through it. And we're putting this magnet in here that has this positive end and has this negative end. And as it drops through, it actually can makes a turbulence in there that slows it down. <laughs> I just uh, did that. There, and now, now we have two magnets. Now here's an interesting experiment, since we have them apart now, is does the amount of magnet matter? So let's drop this one through there. You ready? One 1,000. Well, I was probably getting to about a half. And then the five. One 1,000, two 1,000. So it did take it longer with the bigger magnet, the more magnetism it has. So I hope this video has helped you discover a little bit about electricity. This is a fun one to do at home with your kids. Actually, this is a fun one to do um, even if you're an adult. Because uh, we're, we're actually going to have a video coming up that talks about power generation and also about how transformers actually work. And this is the basics of it. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. And be sure to comment whether you like this type of video because this is something completely new. Do you have something you want to say? Yeah. Yeah. My channel. Yes, Wendell has her own channel, so we'll put a link to it in the description also. So they do some fun experiments over there, you know, some how-tos uh, similar to this. So they may, who knows, they may have their own version of this. Who knows how crazy it'll be. Till next time. Bye. So this is just a fun experiment you can do to, you know, to just give some thought to, hey, what is going on here? What is going on here, Wendell? 
Serious thinking. <laughs> and if you look down both of these, they are identical. <laughs> and what do you think happens? There's some type of force. There's some type of force. Is this like Jedi force? Yes. Hi, this is Tim. <laughs> Don't hit fiddle with your ear. Oh, hold on, let me get it situated. Okay. Oh gosh. Hair problems. You're worse than your mommy. Anything else? Bye. Bye. Yes. Or maybe. <laughs> Hi, this is Tim. And this is Amber of TW Controls. We run the automation store. Be sure to subscribe for more great videos. And like this video and comment on what you would like to see next. Visit our website where we offer a full line of PLCs, simulators, control panels, PLC trainers, and more.